This is his 111th Major League Soccer game, made his debut in 2012. FC Cincinnati will have the first touch. The orange and blue will work left to right and attack away from the Bailey in the first 45 minutes. Certainly a special moment for Mason. Moss, he'll try a shot on <laughs> Kenneth Vermeer, makes the save and kind of dangerously rolls over the ball. Finds Cruz right at the edge of the 18. Now when Cruz takes a shot and Janssen comes sliding in. Word from the Orlando campus, they're prioritizing that match. They want to see it go well, so maybe thinking now he could be used as a sub 20, 25 minutes, but not have as heavy of a workload. Urso has it poked away, then Moss takes a shot. Vermeer dives to the right, pulls it onto his body. Or just hits this, and he doesn't get a, a ton of pierce, actually. It's Moss that actually strikes this, and he hits it with yeah. his left foot, but doesn't get a ton of power behind it. Akindeli into the 18. Tessa Akindeli takes a shot, and Kenneth Vermeer swats it away. Will come from the far side. First of the match for Orlando. Swung into the box. Moss got his head on it, but well wide. Over the near side, Moss. In the middle, Mueller. Around Cruz. Off to Moss. Moss looking for a pass. Gets it into the middle, and it's missed it. Here's Jow, one on three. Over to Acosta. Luciano Acosta. Dancing at the edge of the 18. Turns right-footed shot goes just wide. Acosta into the 18. Cameron was there. He's putting his hand in the air as though maybe there was a handball. Brenner now down grabbing his left ankle after some pressure. Matarita sends it back. Cameron trying to get a header on it. Yeah. Jeff Cameron just to, as the ball was played in from Matarita just not high enough for him to be able to jump and try to get some pierce as he redirects it. Into the box, Mueller lost his footing, but Kyle Smith followed it up and completely mishit it up into the stands. That's a fortunate. Now yeah, look, they lost four to two to DC, to shorthanded DC team that picked up two red cards here last Saturday. Barreal, edge of the 18, takes a left-footed shot. He found what he was looking for and then didn't have the quality he was hoping for. Cruz, Brenner on the right side of Costa. He has Barreal for help. Costa gives it off. Barreal. Across the box. Brenner! Brenner! Brenner at home for the first time in Major League Soccer. And we talked about how important he's going to be in this game as a spotlight player. A lot of times we've talked about lack of service, him having to do things on his own. This time he gets the service. And that's a goal scorer's finish clinical he finds this space he hits it with confidence what a moment here at TQL Stadium first goal for the orange and blue in 342 minutes Orlando and they're all white strip FC Cincinnati in their primary blues they have switched ends FC Cincinnati will attack towards the Bailey for the final 45 minutes we appreciate you tuning in tonight numbers coming in to help four on three now Cruz into the 18, brings it over to Jow. Jow to Brenner. Acosta at the penalty spot. Acosta takes a shot and deflected it away. Kubo follows and it sails high. Diasia heads it away. And Matarita will give chase up the right side. Comes over the back of Mauricio Herrera. And Mata's going to land the book with a yellow card here in the 53rd minute. Replacing Rita to Cruz misplayed it right to the foot of Nani. Nani gets his first touch, takes a shot, and beats Kenneth Vermeer from the edge of the 18. A massive mistake by FC Cincinnati, and Nani has his ninth goal of the season. We are tied up at one apiece. It's just a bad mistake here from Alan Cruz. There's no need for it. That's the battery of the field. And again, you talk about the guy that's played on the world stage. You cannot give him the space. You cannot give him that time because he will punish you. It's a reckless moment for FC Cincinnati. 
called it, partner. Weapons looming on the bench for Orlando. Janssen across midfield. Kubo not able to step to the ball. Biasia not able to clear. Mueller, corner of the 18, takes a shot. Vermeer makes the save. And just sloppy play from FC Cincinnati to give Mueller that space. Is it pretty well, but. Nani right foots it towards the 18. The header was there. Akindeli turned on him but put it high over the frame. Renner has Jow to his left and sends it in that direction. Costa there for help as well. Jow cutting across the mountain. The goal takes a shot right into the hands of Mason Stadar. Kubo steps in the way. Matarita. Brenner taken down hard by Schlegel grabbing his knee and here comes a yellow card for Rodrigo Schlegel. Sends it towards the box. Cameron straight up into the air and I'm trying to clear it but ends up with Correa. Correa over to the left side. I was trying to find Nani. Acosta to Brenner. Brenner stays with it. Brenner. Acosta. Zhao on the left side. Back to Brenner. Turns, takes a shot at a really tough angle. On to the right side, Juan. Juan across the box. Viasia heads it away, and Matarita gets a header to Jao. Jao dragged down from behind. That has to be a yellow card. It will. I'm Chris Mueller here in the 77th minute. Cincinnati tried to get it forward. Mueller across the box, headed on. And outside of the 18, Janssen rips a shot by Asias there defensively. Zhao. Cruz not able to win the ball. Desart was there. Cruz is down in a heap of pain. And Desart's going to lay him in the book in the 84th minute with the yellow card. Right into the match and send a message. But Dunyanin will take the corner kick. Maybe a last opportunity for the orange and blue. But Dunyanin into the box to the far corner. Acosta got his head on it. But into the side netting, didn't have a good angle, and you can see the exhaustion there. Tonga drops it off for Acosta. Acosta unable to get around Perea, and his legs are shot. Full-time whistle in Cincinnati. Exhaustion sets in, another draw for the orange and blue.